everyone this is a kalpana here in this video we are going to solve the given differential equation so let's get going problem solve d cube minus 2d square minus 3d into x equals to 0 where d is a differential operator which is equal to d by dt right so here small d is a independent variable and x is a dependent variable solution given differential equation d cube minus 2d square minus 3d into x equals to 0. So here we are given a linear homogeneous equation, right, where So this is an operator form f of d into x equals to 0 where f of d equals to d cube minus 2d square minus 3. Fine. Okay. You can also write this equation as d cube x by dx cube we'll just write this as d cube into x minus 2 d square into x minus 3 dx equals to 0 and you'll replace differential operator by d by dt then you'll get d cube x by dx cube sorry d t cube t is an independent variable right and minus 2 into d square x by dt square minus 3 into dx by dt equals to 0. So here we will find the order and degree of the given equation. So find the highest derivative in the equation. So d cube x by dt cube is the highest derivative. Then the order will be 3 and coming to the degree, since this is the highest derivative in the equation, so the power, power of the highest derivative will be our degree. So here we have 1. So 1 is the degree of the given equation. The given equation is of order 2 and degree 1. Fine. Now, we'll find the general solution to the given equation using auxiliary equation. The auxiliary equation of f of d into x equals to 0 is f of m equals to 0. So, how will we get f of m where f of m equals to? Simply replace d by m, then you will get f of m. m cube minus 2m square minus 3m. Right? Now, using auxiliary equation, m cube minus 2m square minus 3m equals to 0, we will find the general solution to the given equation. Now, take m, and m common from all these three terms and you'll get m times m square minus 2m minus 3 equals to 0. Then, m into. You can find factors of this polynomial. Consider the polynomial. Using factorization method, you can find the factors m square minus 3m plus 2m minus 3. Sorry. You can split 
minus 2m as minus 3m plus m which is again minus 2m right now take m common from the first two terms you'll get m times m minus 3 plus you can consider m minus 3 the next two terms as a single term now take m minus 3 common from these two terms you'll get m minus 3 times m plus 1 so the factors of this polynomial is m minus 3 into m plus 1 equals to 0. The roots are m equals to 0, right? Equate every factor to 0, then you'll get from this Okay, m equals to 0. Here yeah, you will get m equals to 3. m equals to minus 1. Then m equals to 0. 3 minus 1 are the roots of the auxiliary equation. Are the roots of f of m equals to 0. Right? So, what is the general solution if we have roots m1, m2, m3, then y equals to c1 e power m1x plus c2 e power m2x plus c3 e power m3x. If the roots are real and distinct. See here we don't have any repeated roots and these are real and also distinct, right? So, our general solution will be for the general solution or the general solution is given by y equals to not y here x is the dependent variable, right? And t is the independent variable. So, our solution is given by x equals to c1 e power m1, that is first root 0 into t plus c2 e power second root 3 into t plus c3 into e power third root. Minus 1 into t. Either you can choose m1 as 0, m2 as 0, sorry, m2 as 3 or m3 as 3. That is, sorry, m3 as minus 1 or you can take 0 as m2 or m3 and 3 as m1 or m3 or minus 1 as m2 or m1. You can choose according to your wish. So the general solution is x equals to c1 e power 0 into t is 0 plus c2 e power 3t plus c3 e power minus t. Since e power 0 is 1 then you get c1 plus c2 e power 3t plus c3 e power t. Sorry, minus t. This completes a problem. So we have seen a problem from differential equation in this video. Hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.